Hey guys, my name is Chaotic and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys several new spawn locations on Grand Theft Auto 5 Online where you can find yourself several really cool, highly customized cars. So let's get straight into this video so I can show you guys these locations and some of the cars which you can obtain from them. So along with the release of Grand Theft Auto 5 on the Xbox One and PlayStation 4, there are also a number of new spawn locations around the map of Los Santos where you can find yourself a number of highly customized cars. Now these new car spawn locations are located around the map near the paint and spray custom shops and every custom shop has their own unique car spawn location. So as you can see in the video right now, I'm near the paint and spray shop in Palito Bay where a rat loader is spawned in. The rat loader itself is highly customized and it has some very cool customizations already on it. Now as I'm sure you guys already know, the rat loader spawn location was removed from GTA 5 several months ago, so I guess you could say this is a new spawn location for the rat loader on GTA 5. But allow me to clarify that the rat loader is not the only highly customized car that can spawn at this location. It is also known that the Sand King XL, as well as a number of other cars, can also spawn at this location in Palito Bay. Now trust me when I say this, but it's a very rare occasion when highly customized cars spawn in at this location. What you will find most of the time when you do make your way to this location, the space itself will be empty. But even so, it is a location where these highly modified cars can be found, and at the end of the day, these are rare cars, so it will take you some time to find one of these, or at least get one of these to spawn in. But if you really want to get one of these cars to spawn in, my only recommendations are that you keep driving up and down the road and eventually one will spawn in. Another recommendation that I would also have if you really want to get one of these cars to spawn in is keep finding new sessions and by going from game to game, eventually one of these cars will spawn in. Now something which I'm sure a lot of you guys will be happy to hear about, you can keep any of the vehicles which can be found at these spawn locations because they are not blacklisted or high-end vehicles. So all you have to do is take them back to your garage where you can then store them inside. And you can of course take all of these cars down to the paint and spray shop where even more customizations can be applied. But moving on to another car which I managed to find at one of these spawn locations and as you can see being featured in the video right now is the Sabre Turbo. I managed to find this car in one of the parking bays parked outside the Los Santos Customs but once again this car is highly upgraded and has a number of modifications already on it. But what you can of course do is take this back to your garage where you can store it inside or you can take it into the Los Santos Customs and add even more upgrades to it. But as previously mentioned, there is a spawn location for cars just like this one, which are highly customized at every paint and spray shop around the map. Now most of the cars which can be found at these locations are highly upgraded and are very valuable, so what you can of course do is take the cars into the paint and spray shop where they can be sold to make yourself a fair bit of money. But apart from that guys, that is all I have for this video, but I do hope you guys have enjoyed it and I hope you find this video useful. If you guys could take a few seconds out of your day to click the like button, it would help me out a lot and it's also greatly appreciated. Also be sure to leave a comment on this video and tell me what cars you find at these spawn locations and if you have not subscribed to my channel already recommend that you do because I upload all the latest and the greatest Grand Theft Auto 5 content. So anyway guys thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time.